Hey what's up guys welcome back to our channel technology and today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to set up a two-factor authentication in your RDP means remote desktop so you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel technology so without wasting any more time let's get started so here is my remote desktop virtual machine as you can see so so first of all you need to go to this website which I'll give you the link on my video description the rohost.com after go to this website you have to click on this download button download now and as you can see one software is downloaded on my computer automatically now click on view download or you can go through your download folder just go to your download folder from here and after that you have to open this software on your computer on your virtual machine and click on ok now after that click on next now click on I accept the agreement so let me let me tell you guys this software is free for 15 days trial so after that you have to purchase so so after that click on next and click on create our desktop icon and click on next and then install and after that click on finish now after open this software on your virtual machine you have to click on this option button and select here from the drop down the first option you have to select Google Authenticator OTP and no need to select these things just click on OK. After that click on Setup OTP Token so click over there and now you have to select Google Authenticator this one and after that click on this display QR code. So click over there and automatically download one PNG on your computer. So you have to open that PNG and after that So after that you have to go to your mobile and search over there Google Authenticator. So let me search first Google the first one. So this one you need to install. So after that you have to click on open button. So click on open and you will get a skin like this. Okay. So you have to click on begin and you have to click on scan a barcode sorry click on this first option which is scan a barcode so click over there and now you have to scan this barcode from your mobile and after that that account will be added on your google authenticator okay so now what you have so now again you have to open the your uh, rohost login key and click on setup otp token and click on ok so minimize all these things so now what you have to do you need to click on this learn more option so now you have to select few questions and answer over there because whenever your google authenticator will not work then this you can uh, through this you can unlock your pc so the first one is car model so i will put here car one second option i will choose here uh, nickname I will put here same thing nickname the third one I will select here school and the fourth one I will select here pass so after select the question and answer you have to click on ok and click on ok and now go to options over there and here you need to select active skin server from here and from here you have to select for any users okay and after that make sure that you have checked this option require user to type windows password along with the key and after that click on ok and after that you have to restart your computer your virtual machine so after done now let me reconnect
so now put your password over there so here is the password for my VPS and after put the password you have to click on OK now click on yes and after that you will get this OTP screen so now go to your mobile and check your OTP which is 64614 uh, six one four three four three okay you can see over there okay so now click on enter from your keyboard now as you can see it's working perfectly so I hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any questions or questions then comments down below I will see you guys on the next one next video take care